There we go. We're right side up now. <laughs> Hi everyone. It's Bev DeBono with Tuesday's Tip. Today I want to show you how to do a really quick and easy page with the Creative Memories 12 inch wavy trimmer and just one sheet of double sided designer paper and a background and only three cuts. Okay, so to get started, what you really need is a designer paper that has a really nice uh, contrast to it so that you can use both sides of it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut uh, two sides together and I'm going to do it on this side so that you could see and I'm, I'm going to um, do a double page spread. So the first thing that I want to do is I'm going to use my tool for my measurements and I'm going to line my paper up between the uh, two lines here. There is a block down from the top and a block up from the bottom and those are where we're going to center our paper. And we're going to be using this swell edge, which is a very soft uh, swirl wave. All right, and I'm going to lift my arm up to the left. I'm going to center my paper onto my trimmer, my wavy trimmer. One block down from the top, one block up from the bottom, and all the way to the edge of the trimmer. And I'm going to make my first cut. Then I am going to uh, mark my paper at the three and three quarter inch mark, which is one block over from the four inch mark. Don't know if you could see that. It's one block over from the four inch mark. And I'm going to mark that right here on the bottom edge of my paper at three and three quarters. Then I'm going to move my paper over and I'm going to move that mark that's at three and three quarters to this cut line that's on the trimmer. And you can see when we lift up the arm, there's a cut line that's very defined here in the trimmer. And I'm going to move that mark that I made over to the cut line, center it at the one block up from the bottom, one block down from the top. And I'm going to make another cut. And I'm going to do the same thing again. And I'm going to mark it at the three and three quarter mark lift it up and go to the cut line again center it at the top and the bottom on your trimmer and those are your three cuts now you will have this left over and you can do another page with this or you can do some layers with that on another page And so we're going to take the three of these that we cut and we have them, they look like this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, just flip over one, flip over one, Okay, maybe it was this flip. There we go. So I'm going to flip over one, flip over one. Oops. Here we go. Flip, flip, and flip. And then I have enough to do the other side, exactly on the other side with the reverse pattern. So I will do that on the other side with the reverse. Okay, and then we're ready to just add 
an embellishment and at the top here or here and tape it down and you have a very quick quick and easy page using the creative memories 12 inch wavy trimmer and this does two waves it does the swell edge which is the one that we worked with today but it also does this really nice wavy one and it's a nice contrast if you have one going in um, I can take this and just kind of randomly select where I'm going to cut it. I just want to show you what this edge looks like. And that one has a lot more um, waves to it. And you can line these up. It's a really pretty, another really pretty edge to make um, on another border. And this is a really great, and you can do so many different things with this trimmer. You can also line the wavy up with just a swell edge. And then look at that with the three layers, um, one, two, and three. And that's a really cool, that's a really cool idea as well. So I hope you enjoyed the tip. Um, this is using the wavy trimmer and making a really quick page. Um, this is my sample page here with um, the words uh, family. And I can also do it, you can flip it and have it go on its side and have a nice border along the edge. And that makes a really pretty page as well and you can do a double page spread with that. Okay, so I hope that you enjoyed um, my pages today. All right, I have a YouTube channel called Bev DeBono Designs. Please subscribe and you'll know when I am posting more content and also um, like it and that helps me with um, the um, getting views. Okay, thanks a lot, bye-bye.